This is about Zena. Zena's my traveling companion. And as we travel, uh, what makes her a good travel companion is she's entertaining. Uh, and little kids and people just love to see her do, do tricks. So what we're going to do now is I'm going to show you a little bit of what Zena can do. Okay. Okay. If I, she'll sit on something for an hour or even more. Uh, but if I just have her sit on the ground, the flat ground, she'll kind of forget and kind of move on. But by putting her on something, she'll sit there for a long period of time. And uh, I don't just give her food. What I do is I throw it to her. And this way, little kids can just, like, especially this is bread, and I can just take a piece and just throw it to her. And this way, uh, they don't have to uh, touch her tongue or, you know, when, they're, when she grabs it out of their, their hands, the, the teeth might scare them and stuff like that. So the little kids like it like this. Okay, vamos. Okay. Okay. Then what if we can do? Oh yeah, I got it. What we do is we give it to her. We can throw it up high and she'll get it. Or we can put it on her put it on her nose. Stay. Stay. Okay. Hey. And then she can get it like that. Or I'll take it. And then I'll go, boom. And then she, boom. She's dead dog. And just throw it to her. Okay. She'll get it. I say, those are the main tricks that just everybody likes. She can travel with me because she only eats the food that I give her. She won't just eat anything off the street. Before she eats, she'll look at me to make sure it's okay to eat it. This way I know she's not, not going to eat anything contaminated. Or drinking out of a, a water, water puddle. She won't drink out of a water puddle. She drinks out of my water, my bottled water. I'll pour it in my hand. She'll drink it out of, her, out of my hand. But that's what makes Zena a good traveling companion.